Welcome everyone, I'm Dragana Kalezik and thanks for joining us today on Money Wars TV. China looks like bailing out BP by buying up to 9 billion US dollars of energy assets in South America, which will rise vital money for the British oil company to pay the bill for the mess in the Gulf of Mexico. Russian companies are also eyeing BP assets as both China and Russia fight for resources that will be badly needed in the future. So while the Obama government get on their cap and trade campaign to get America off their appetite for oil, other countries like China and Russia are happy to use the existing resources of the world so as not to damage their economies in the process. We will be focusing more on the cap and trade bill in America over the coming weeks as this may well be a major world scam that you need to know about. Here's a bit of history for you. When was the first printing of funny money or bills not backed by any gold actually made? Well, on June 22nd, 1776, the Continental Congress decided to issue its own currency and issued some two million worth of continental bills. George Washington even complained that a wagon load of currency will hardly purchase a wagon of provisions. By the end of the war, the new currency was worthless and hence the phase came into fashion, not worth a continental. We should learn from this that fiat currency backed by nothing may well end up worthless and hence the US dollar may end up like the continental. Thanks for watching and God bless.